unemployment and service delivery are some of the issues my man touched on during his visit at Guanabutle Township in Kariha. He says at least one person per household should be employed. He also promised to take the Nelson Mandela Bay Metro to Constitutional Court over service delivery. My money lambasted the ruling party, saying it has failed South Africans since 1994. Today we went to Guanobutle and it was very clear that the community is lacking in the basic service delivery of water. I compound that with electricity, this becomes a place that we need to contest for, fight for change. Because these issues are affecting not only South Africans, but in a province such as this one, where poverty levels are high, we need to work at bringing about that change. Guanobuhle Township has one police station that services a large population. The community says more needs to be done. There's nothing here by us. So in the end of the day, people, people tell me Musi is coming. I tell them I'm very happy for Musi to come so that Musi can see how our people stay. Yes, people were staying in the zinc houses for 27 years. Our people is, is, is don't have, there's no, no work. Um, our youngsters is hungry and um, sometimes they go out and do some stuff, stealing and breaking in in houses. My money is adamant that his party will make it to the ballot paper. Because the IEC is making a requisition that we need to comply with the signature threshold, which is a matter that is before the Constitutional Court, we have then requested for citizens to sign up. And, and it's been very positive. People are signing on, they are online, and I'm encouraging more and more citizens to do that. My money has also promised to visit this area frequently to assess whether or not basic services have been rendered. Zolani Moya, SABC News, Karicha in the Eastern Cape.